yeah so i think in the last class uh, we discussed about joins joins are used to retrieve the data from more than one table different types of joins we have seen so let us write some queries basically here i'll try to open some sql work my sql my sql workbench i'll try to open okay let us write some basic queries i think have you practiced this uh, uh which one cross join and self join in the last session we have discussed so here you can create some tables here actually two tables are there already department table and student table is there if you want once you can check this one this is your table data student number student name department number if you want you can directly insert the values just to select the table at the edge you can see a small uh, image like table is there if you want to insert you can directly insert here i have one table with name d department table just select here i'll try to insert some values department number 10 ec 20 here i'll try to go csc 30 i'll try to go triple e my sql i'm teaching queries okay na? this is how you can execute and again once we can uh, write this query select star from department execute oh it was not saved i think if you want you can insert the record in department insert into dept values of you can you can give some values 10 comma here you can give some ec semicolon execute one record is inserted when i'm getting all this stuff okay dept na yes select star from dept coming and going back first use the database use stdb select the query execute and then select start from stdb dot dept execute and again insert the record execute one record is inserted 20 csc select the query execute so two records are there and you can create one more uh, you can write select star from this one and select star from student table also if you want these are the two tables right this is department table and this is my student table yeah in student table also i'll try to insert the records insert into student values of i'll insert some values 101 comma anil comma 10 anil is working some ec department similarly 2 3 4 5 some five records you can insert here you can give 102 here 103 104 105 here you can give anil sunil here you can give something like ajay here you can give vijay here you can give john and here also you can give some value something like 20 here 20 here 30 okay that is enough so select the queries execute once again now try to write select star from student okay na now i want to write one join query write a join query to display the employee details student details along with department name how to write select yes dot s number comma yes dot s name 
comma d dot d name from student s nr join dept d student s nr join dept d on s dot d number is equal to d dot d number select the query execute see the output so you got the student number student name and d name so our query is working whatever we have written are you following like that you can practice the queries if i want to display the uh, 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 employed uh, student details who are enrolled in ec department what to do here you can write select select s dot s number comma s dot s name okay na Co from from student s nr join student s nr join department d on on s dot s dot d number is equal to d dot d number s dot d number is equal to d dot d number where d dot d name is equal to ec something like this i want to display the students who are enrolled in ec department so three students are there anil sunil and john means whatever the queries i explained you in uh, last two to three days you can practice those queries it will work okay if you want you can check this uh, you can practice all the queries they will work and yesterday we created one table now self join also you can test if you want so i'll try to create one table create table em mm, otherwise employee create table employee um, column names i will try to give e number data type i'll give int comma e name data type i'll give var char var char of some 30 comma data type i'll uh, column name i'll give mid manager id data type i'll give as int so no so i want to create one table with name employee It understood here let us see whether the query is executed or not you can check here hmm. now here you can see this one also want to close here Now let us check whether the table is uh, created or not. DSC space table name employee. Select execute. Yeah, table is created. E number, E name, MID. Are you following everyone? So here I will try to insert the record. Insert into employee. Yesterday video you watch if you have any doubts. Values of employee number one. Employee name I will give Anil. Manager ID, I'll give null. Select the query, execute. Like this, you can copy. Two, three, four, five, six. Here you can give two. Two is Sunil. Sunil manager is Anil. So here you can give one. And here you can give three. Three I will give as Ajay. Ajay manager is one and here I'll try to give four. Four I'll try to give as James. James manager is two and here I'll try to give five. Five Robert. Here I'll try to give three. Here I'll give six. Six I'll give Rahim. Here I'll give um, four. So I want to display the employee name along with manager names. Execute. Now here you can write select star from employee. Execute. 
Okay, now I want to write the self-join query. Select e dot e name as employee name. I should have explained. Comma m dot e name as manager from employee from employee e join employee m on e dot m id is equal to m dot e number so this is the self join so employee name ajay manager is anil sunil manager is anil james manager is sunil robert manager is ajay rahim manager is james okay